Breaking news, ladies and gentlemen, breaking news. Two personnel connected to the Berlinium company has been arrested in a hundred million dollar seizure. Greetings and salutations to all nation. Ladies and gentlemen, you know it's your favorite Jamaican. This is far right soldier here of Deepwoods TV. Thank you for tuning in to the Rastaman channel. If you have not subscribed as yet, hit that red subscribe button. Follow me on TikTok, ladies and gentlemen, as we are reported to has been arrested in a million dollar seizure linked to the troubled Berlinium company as two individuals in Portmore St. Catrill connected to the armored carrying company Berlinium were arrested on Tuesday following the seizure of over 100 million in the gated community in Caribbean Estate, Portmore. The suspect, both are 32, including a treasury custodian currently employed by Berlinium and his common law spouse, who is former employee of the company. Their arrest marked a troubling chapter for the Berlinium, which is facing series of armored robbery targeting in cash and transit team, with robbers frequently making off with large sum of cash. The recent spat of attack has often involved violent confrontation, particularly at a automated banking machine, and has occurred in various major town center, including Portmore, Mandeville, and Negril. The most notable incident occurred in July when police fatally shot four men doing an attempt heist in the grill. During Tuesday's operation, authorities seized more than $64 million Jamaican, over 300,000 U.S. and 11,000 pounds from the suspect's resident, raising serious concerns about the com couple's involvement in the illicit activities. Assistant Commission of Police, Anthony McLaughlin, head of Jamaica's Constable Force Counterterrorism and Organized Crime Investigation Branch, the CTOC, confirmed that the couple will be charged with lottery scamming. He highlighted a disturbing trend, noting a notable increase in lottery scamming utilizing firearms in their operations. The investigation into the subsequent seizure will be a collaboration effort including the Financial Investigation Division, the Major Organization Crime and Anti-Corruption Agent, and the U.S. Embassy. Authorities continue to address the growing menace of lottery scamming, which pose a significant threat to the public safety and the financial integrity of Jamaica. Wow, ladies and gentlemen, you hear what's going on. Two person, one family employed by Berlinium and one currently a treasure custodian has been arrested and these suspects are arrested on lottery scamming charges over 64 million dollar Jamaica currency. They said also they had 300,000 US dollars and 11,000 pounds. Are the three top currency in Av? I'm telling you, because right now in Jamaica, all this scamming that's going on, touching, foreign, the land of barren, it appears that the violence turn up as Mr. McLaughlin, the superintendent of CTOC, is stating that it appears that these scammers are not just in for the nyamin, they're also in for the quenging because the scammers are getting more violent. Superintendent McLaughlin said the scammers are using firearms for defend them paperwork. So ladies and gentlemen, if you know we're good for you, when you see a man a scam, 
When you see a man and yam, see and blind and hear and deaf. I'm Rastafari Soldier here of Deep Roots TV. But if you're scamming and you get catch, you forget where you get. Just like these two. Two former Berlinium, because I could say farmer now, Berlinium employee. Both in a personal relationship. They have not released their name, but trust me, when me get them name, I will be telling you. Because it's over a hundred million dollar they have. And they're smart enough to be arrested over 300,000 US and over 11,000 pounds. Well, when you have the money pound ends, I never know what to do with it. So now, the government forward, including the U.S. Embassy, and I'm going to take it off of you. If you get away with some paper, I suggest you invest it in a, some brick and mortar store. You are going to tea. No store ripped up under your bed. Because the bed can't hide it from the feds. We have two farmer workers at Berlinium. Berlinium. Now, I'm not saying that any of this money come from the robbery, so that's why I want to clarify that one of them is a farmer worker at Berlinium, and one of them is a secretary or treasure, treasurer at Berlinium. So, I don't want enough to mix up that these two people are in the robbery heist that's been going on on Berlinium. Because the Jamaican government didn't find such evidence, they have charged them with lottery scamming. A hundred million dollar seizure linked to two employees at Berlinium. Leave your comment on this one, people, and let me know why these people continue to get away with so much money and getting themselves caught. Port more Jamaica. I'm Rastafari Soldier here of Deep Roots TV. I'm more life and more joy. Subscribe if you have not subscribed and leave your comment, ladies and gentlemen. Bless up yourself. Deep Roots TV with gun time for the action card. Yeah. <laughs> cool, Jenna, Jenna. Oh, you know about it, Pops? Cool,